first time this song is written by one poet. This song actually is from Bandar Abbas, which is South Iran. Like Jamal, Jamal, like Jamal, you have dark skin in Iran. Hmm. Uh, people will like this. It's a very sad romance. That four countries are speaking Farsi language. Ek kalle chehre wale ladke, mujhe pareshan mat karo. Imara thi aami sir. Hmm. Dumja chehra, bahut sundar hai. Namaste, Namaste dosto. आपका नए वीडियो में स्वागत है वी विल स्टार्ट विद जमा जमा लू सॉन्ग एज आई एम इरेनियन सॉन्ग ऑल्सो इज इरेनियन एंड इज सो मच ट्रेंडिंग आई वॉन्ट टू एक्सप्लेन द मीनिंग ऑफ सॉन्ग फॉर यू गाइज सो द सॉन्ग विच इज इन ट्रेंडिंग नाउ जमाल जमालू सो बेसिकली इट्स इरानियन सॉन्ग फर्स्ट टाइम दिस सॉन्ग इज रिटन बाय वन पोएट हुज नेम इज आई डोंट रिमेम्बर वॉट वॉज द नेम बीजान समांदर बीजान समांदर हु वॉज द पोएट Then in 1950, some girls in school uh, they sing this song together. Mm -hmm. From that time, it was in trend. So after that, lot of Iranian singer tried to copy this song and tried to sing. Uh, so lot of history behind it now because of new movie in Bollywood that is Animal. Mm -hmm. This song is in so much trend in India. So and I have to mention that this song actually is from Bandar Abbas. which is south iran mm -hmm. so there lots of cultural uh, similarities are there as we mentioned little bit in uh, previous video lots of cultural similarities they have to india mm -hmm. like if they want to say yes they also say ha or uh, some indian ladka ladki something ladka ladki or if they so they didn't they didn't know ki these words are from hindi yes it's like because of the connection in past uh. they had uh like export import and these things so that's why lot of connection still also is there and uh the language also even the color of their skin also is so much close to mm. indians yeah so let's start with let's huh. start. so now beta will start the explaining the meaning of song so i will start with first line of the song oh hi sia hazangi dela monaco khun Siyah means kala means black. Okay. So siyah is zangi. Zangi means roasted. Roast. Ah, oh, zang. We also have zang. Zangi means in Marathi we have word zang. Maybe really? we say that zang is dry. Means uh, it got roast. Iron got roast. Really? Uh. We say zang is dry. What you say? Zang. No, the sentence. Zang is dry. Means like. Zang. Third line means like it's getting raw. How close we say zang zade? Uh, and it means it got raw. Uh, another word uh, meaning also is zang means like fight or war is like zang. Uh, but it's different. But for here is similar zang. Yeah. Uh, so ahai si ahai zang ki ahai means like it's like you are calling someone. Uh -huh. yeah, in Hindi or English you say hey. Uh -huh. In Farsi also say ahai. Okay. So it's like ahai. Sia has angry means hey, she is saying the singer is singing for the person who has dark color of skin, mm -hmm. and I will tell you why the singer uh, sang the song like this mm -hmm. because actually uh, people from South Iran mostly have uh, dark skin, mm -hmm. they are kala, uh, similar to Indians. So that's why singer I told you is from South Iran this song. So that's why singer also is saying. Ahai sia hazangi means hey the person who is dark color dark mm -hmm. skin and like roasted okay del monaco khun del means heart we also say del yeah uh. it's same del monaco khun khun means blood we, we also like, khun is blood in hindi also really ha uh. it's like saying don't make my heart bloody something like uh. this uh means like uh, you can say it's like some expression is saying like don't bother me don't uh, make me sad uh, something like this it's like uh, if you say delamo khun kardi means like you make me so sad so much annoyed uh, like this so in song saying don't annoy me don't uh, make my heart bloody something like uh, this and next line you know what is the next line no Tell me that some part has much known. And how I know it's so hard. Oh, I see. Oh, he's angry. Della Monaco, khun. Din 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 din. Much known. I don't know this much. I know. After that, it will be. Oh, I thought after he could jaw. Man, I'm so much known. 
means uh, ahai thorafti koja ahai that is same hey something like this so again singer is saying where you went ahai thorafti koja koja means koja where? means you are son of ours uh. uh and rafti means where you went something uh. like this so he saying ahai thorafti koja man as to majnoon man in hindi you say me me we say man, man. to tum you say tum, na ha man to so song is saying man as to majnoon means i am in love i am majnoon of you okay i am in love with you mm. where you went Uh, Majnu also is a Hindi word. Yeah, Majnu is like mad in love, something like this. Yeah. Uh. Uh, same like that movie was na uh, Leila Majnu. Ah, uh, Leila Majnu. Uh. Uh. So uh, can you explain together all meaning of this two line? Yeah. In English. Uh, it's like from starting if I say is that um, hey the person who is uh, black uh, skin and ro- uh, roasted. Roasted. um don't make my heart bloody means like don't annoy me where you went i am much more of you i am in love with uh. you and after that in next line is jamal 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 no not jamal 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 kudum kudum okay so i will say the meaning okay. actually jamal in uh, i think is name of some people also in india because i know one woman her husband name is jamal i don't know i in never india. heard no it is there okay. i know uh, in iran also we have some uh-huh. people uh, means is for boys okay. boys name is jamal so i will say actually in old farsi jamal means like face face beautiful face okay hmm. uh-huh. like jamal 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 hmm. jamal qudum means your beautiful face beautiful face is saying again again back to back and at the end jamalu qudum means your beautiful face okay face means like, like step. step one step he uh, took for walking or like this yeah huh. uh so it's mentioning like your face is beautiful your face is beautiful uh, like means this. like okay face also beautiful step also for walking you took that yeah. is also means like it's like style how you are walking No it's huh. like you're giving so much love to someone oh, for everything like you are in love with huh, okay your everything is so good even your walking is beautiful uh, your height is beautiful okay yeah huh. and actually in this song i have to mention uh, that uh, if you have dark skin in iran huh. uh, people will like lot of people will say you are so cute mm. and um means song is not saying in bad way like you have dark skin uh. you know song is saying in so good way even i want to mention this one here we have one expression in farsi uh, my mom always sing for bhagwan safit safit sat to man sorkh safit si sat to man hala ke resid be sabze har chi begi mi arze which means if you are white you uh, value 100 to man to man is like currency we have you rupees they like have 100 rupees ha uh. huh? Huh. So it's like if you are white, your value is hundred rupees. Huh. If you are normal, like huh. not white, not black, huh. your value is three hundred rupees. Okay. But if you are do- you have dark skin, huh. your value is not um, coming in money as money. It's like inf- uh, infinite. Hmm. So see how beautiful uh, things are in Persian language. Yeah. So uh, can you sing again for people? And this also I have to mention. Huh? In Iran we have different types of color, huh. so it's not like everyone. Even I am also normal. I am not white. I am not uh, black. If you go to like uh, some areas, you'll find so much white color. If you go south part, you will find like when I went, I was so feeling so good and different. Mm. I was like, it's like India south. Part I of also Iran. went to south, and thing is, I forgot my passport at home in Tehran. Oh my god! So they didn't check me because I was looking like them only there. Yeah. They didn't ask me passport. Even say in south part, people love so much India mostly. Uh, in maybe in like they always, capital city. They always listen Indian song, Bollywood yeah. song, Salman Khan song. Maybe in capital city, like my city, lots of people will be acting so classy, like uh, what is India, what is this. Uh, But if you go south part, 
people are also comfortable like Indian mm. and they eat Indian food mm. they uh, listen to Indian songs Samo Salsa, salsa. Yeah. 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 like uh, one actor we got during uh, yeah. he was playing all Hindi songs yeah <laughs> uh, at also you will find like village actors are there yeah. if you see in village Indian village same kind of actors you will find there but other places is not there uh, like only in south part I saw yeah, that's why South part, I always wanted to show Bhagwan and uh, when he came to Iran that time was summer uh, in summer South part is so, so hot. hot like same like but still in India. I was like I want to take him I want to take him. I want him to see it's like India only no different Alright. can you sing again that Safed uh, ha, ha. Safed Safed Sat Toman Sorkho Safed Si Sat Toman Hala Ke Resit Be Sabze Har shi begi means whatever money you say is valuable for it. Okay. It has value of it. Yeah. One interesting thing I want to say about uh, Farsi language is that four countries are speaking Farsi language. Okay. Iran, Uzbekistan, mm-hmm. Afghanistan, Tajikistan. Tajikistan. Okay. These four huh. countries. So. Uh, uh, it's not like it's only for my country, but I just want to uh, tell you guys how interesting is Farsi language. It's the only language that has no gender. Like if you want to call someone or mm. like I want to say that person called me, you will not find that person is girl or boy. Means uh, there is no pronoun. Like in English we have she, she or she. she, but in Farsi language only one word. Yeah. To, to na? No, if you want to say that person, huh. Tho means you. Huh. He, there's no he or she. Okay. You say you. Huh. If you want to say he or she about huh. someone, like huh. I want to say that person called me, huh. then he will not understand. I am saying about one girl or boy. So what is that word? U. U. Huh. Huh. U means that U person. We have one letter in <laughs> letter letter in Hindi. U or in Marathi. Huh. Uh, I, U. What do you say? U. U. U is like he or she. Okay. So you will not understand. Oh, it's girl it's so or boy. Yeah. So they don't so have discrimination. So you can say discrimination <laughs> of gender really. Uh. I'm not saying about country. I'm saying about language. Because mm. it's so old language now. Uh, so there is no discrimination. So one video also we will make later about Farsi language. If you guys also like. Uh, we will explain a little bit like how different things we say in Farsi. Maybe... I think it is so interesting. Mm. You will be sure. Maybe like some, uh, what should I say? Some sentences. Or, sentences, no. Uh, like muhavra we say in uh, Hindi. Muhavra. Uh, muhavra. Oh, we say muhavra. You also say, huh? <laughs> so, so like, Are, how many similar uh, words do you So have? like that kind of things we can do one video and we can explain uh, properly to you. And if you watch that, you will be so much... Like, you will understand it's so emotional. Um, Maybe a lot of things are similar. And you know, India, we have lots of old poets in Farsi that uh, even Indians people also, like some few Indians that they know Farsi language, huh. they are saying like, if you know Farsi and if you read poem, huh. you will get mad how emotional and how oh, nice it is. Let's see. Yeah. Now I will try to explain in Hindi. Vita, so, so you sp- tell me in uh, English the meaning of song so i'll try to explain in hindi okay means the person who is dark skin hmm. don't make my heart bloody or don't annoy me okay so this means that a kale chehre wale ladke mujhe pareshan mat karo oh hai to rafti ko jo man as to majnoon where did you go i am majnoon i am in love with you hey ladke kaha chale gaye tumhare pyar mein main majnoon ban gayi so after that it is what I want? Jamal Jamalu 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 Kudum Jamalu Kudum Jamal means beautiful face okay. So in Hindi say uh, like he is saying you have beautiful face you have beautiful face hmm. So Jamal this much this much only meaning Yeah it is. it's again again repeating Oh so it's like same so its meaning is that the poet is saying that uh, beauty, तुम्हारा आपका face beautiful है और आपका चलना भी beautiful है. तुम्हारा चेहरा 
बहुत पसंद है बहुत सुंदर है सुंदर है सुंदर इज मराठी सो पोइट कह रहा है कि आपका चेहरा सुंदर है आपका चलना सुंदर है सो so, मतलब इसलिए वो कह रहा है कि इतना दीवाना हो आपके प्यार में तो so, ऐसा कह रहा है एक काले चेहरे वाले लड़के कहा चले गए आपके वजह में परेशान हो गई फिर फिर वो कह रहा है कि फिर क्या कह रहा है कहा चले गए तुम्हारे प्यार में मैं मजनू बन गया और मजनू बन गई और फिर लास्ट वाला और आपका चलना आपका चेहरा सब सब कुछ ब्यूटीफुल है सब कुछ सुंदर है सब कुछ सुंदर है फारसी लैंग्वेज बहुत सुंदर है अरे बहुत सुंदर है सो इन मराठी ऑल्सो कैन आई टेल सो इन मराठी इफ आई वॉन्ट ओके बेटा चेहरा चेहरा इन मराठी आई विल से चेहरा बहुत सुंदर है सेम ना नो बट स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम स्टार्टिंग है अरे काला हा एक काले चेहर मीन्स काळ्या चेहऱ्याच्या मुला मीन्स का काळ्या चेहऱ्याच्या मुला मुला कुठे गेलास कुठे गेलास आय नो इज मॉ मला कुठे गेलास कुठे गेलास मे तुम तुमचे परेशान मी तुमच्यासाठी परेशान झालो झालं सॉरी सॉरी एक काया चेहऱ्याच्या मुला कुठे गेलास एक काया चेहऱ्याच्या मुला कुठे गेला गेलास आय नो मोहम्मद कुठे गेलास का व्हेरी गुड आणि आफ्टर दॅट वेट डोन्ट से सुंदर आहे तुमचं चालन सुंदर आहे तुमच्या चालना सुंदर आहे इन मी सांगायचं तर असं सांगतो की पूर्ण पूर्ण मिनिंग सांगतो मी सांगितले बिटन आता थोडं थोडं सांगितले आता मी पूर्ण सोबत सांगतो की तू म्हणणार नाही की एक काळ्या चेहऱ्याच्या मुला कुठे गेलास तुझ्या प्रेमामध्ये मी दिवाणी झाली माझ्या माझ्या हिंदी बहुत खराब झाले ही हिंदी इज नॉट गुड माझ्या मराठी अपलिफ्टिंग ऍक्च्युली गायज आय एम फ्रॉम महाराष्ट्र असो आय नो मराठी मराठी दॅट इज ऑल्सो फ्रॉम विलेज अँड हिंदी ऑल्सो इट्स लाईक हिंदी मराठी मिक्स सो वेन युअर आय स्पीक इवन फॉर एक्सप्लेनिंग हर और टेलिंग हर हाव हाव हिंदी अँड मराठी इट्स लाईक मिक्स शी इज असं लर्निंग मिक्स विथ मी हिंदी अँड मराठी इधर बसा इथे बसा उधर बसा उधर बैठो सो इट्स लाईक मिक्स थँक्यू गायज फॉर वॉचिंग दिस व्हिडिओ वी होप यू लाईक इट वॉट एव्हर वी मेक इट्स जस्ट फ्रॉम अवर हर्ट सो वी डोंट प्रिपेअर एनिथिंग फॉर दिस व्हिडिओ यू जस्ट सी इट अँड वी थॉट to explain yeah. the meaning because a lot of people are asking in below comment like uh, explain the meaning explain the meaning so we try to explain in english hindi and marathi uh, so forgive us if we said something wrong because we are not that much uh, what should i say pure in hindi and marathi we, we tried our best and we love both iran and india so thank you so much for thank watching thank you so much video. for watching our video take care take care bye, bye.